today's problem that I'm going to show you with our strategy, which is using models, is using the problem that there are six students in a group, and each student works for one and a half hours. So when I go ahead and write out that problem, well, that's really doing six times one and a half. So it says, what is the total amount of time that they spend working on a group project? So I'm going to go ahead and take my 6, and I'm going to go ahead and draw 6 whole. And I'm going to go ahead and shade in my 6 holes. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 holes. But then I still have my half. So I'm going to go ahead and draw next to each one another hole and then partition it into halves. So I have half, 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 half. And then I'm going to go ahead and shade that. So there's half, 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 and half. Now what I'm going to do next is I'm going to go ahead and take some of my halves and move them over to my empty halves. That means this one right here, I'm going to go ahead and bring over here, and I'm going to go ahead and shade that in. So now I have one half plus one half. This is now equivalent to one whole. This one right here, I'm going to go ahead and bring over and shade in. So now I have another one half and one half is equal to one whole. This half right here, I'm going to go ahead and regroup right here so it's into another one hole. I'm then going to go through and I'm going to go ahead and cross off my ones that I don't need anymore. So I don't need this anymore, I don't need this anymore, and I don't need this anymore. I don't want it to confuse me when I get ready to add up my total amounts. Now I'm going to go back through and I'm going to go ahead and add up my holes. So I have one hole, two hole, three hole, four hole, five hole, six hole, seven hole, eight hole. So I know six times one and a half is equal to eight hole. And then my question was how many hours? So I know it would have been eight hours that they spent working. If I check this using that check mark method that I had taught you earlier, I would go ahead and I would do six times one and a half. I know I'm going to set six whole over one multiplied by, okay, now I need to do my check mark method. So one times two is two plus one is Three, so I'm going to get 3 over 2. So I'm going to multiply now. 1 times 2 is 2. 6 times 3 is um, 18. So 2 goes into 18 9 times. Hmm, 9 hours. Well, that doesn't match what I got over here. So what did I do? Oh, I see what I did wrong. Look what I did, fifth grade. I missed this one hole right there. So I know that I really didn't have eight hole, but I had nine hole. This is why it is so important to double check your answer. And I'm so glad I did because when I looked at my picture, I realized that I missed circling that one hole over there. So my answer is going to be nine hours. You're going to want to do both methods drawing a picture, but also showing me with the multiplication on these.